Hi, I'm Steve from Yoga Gal Support. Welcome to another Exaquantum training video. In this video, I will demonstrate how to connect to the ARA analysis database and create a custom report in Microsoft Excel. Beginning with Microsoft Excel open, choose the data menu. Select from other sources and choose analysis services. Enter the name of the ARA server and click next. Or use a dot for local server. Select the events cube and choose next. Give the connection file a name and click finish. Now choose where you wish the pivot table to be located. To configure the pivot table data, fields need to be added to the report. The user can expand one of the categories from the pivot table field list and select fields to add to the report. To add a field, either tick the box next to the option or drag the field title into one of the areas at the bottom of the panel. Items with the SUM symbol are measures such as the number of alarms, shelved alarms or suppressed alarms. Items with the table symbol are dimensions by which measures are broken down such as by plant, by operator or by time period. For meaningful reports measures need to be in columns and dimensions in rows or vice versa. Let's create a simple report of alarm count by time. Alarm count's already selected. If we want our time interval, to be in the rows, we can drag between column and row, and the layout changes. To modify pivot table fields and appearance, there are two pivot table tools menus. The options menu contains items related to the table data itself. The design menu contains items to change the appearance of the table. Once the table has the data you require, you can also create a pivot chart. You can find out more on pivot tables from the Microsoft Excel documentation and there are also numerous tutorials on YouTube itself. That's all for this video. Thanks for watching.